In January, I underwent major abdominal surgery in London, and at the time, it was thought that my condition was non-cancerous. The surgery was successful. However, tests after the operation found cancer had been present. It has been one of, if not the biggest talker of the day. Kate Middleton has been diagnosed with cancer. This is according to the Princess of Wales herself, who released that video earlier today explaining her absence of more than three months from public life. After the royal family released the video this afternoon, social media users quickly reflected on the risk of cancer, especially in women. And earlier, Cassie spoke to a local cancer patient and a Novant Health oncologist about how important cancer screenings are. Cassie. And Neil, the recommendations per the American Cancer Society for four of those common ca cancers are as follows. So for colorectal cancer, you're going to want to start getting screenings at about 45 years old. For breast cancer, the age is 40 to 44, but if you're high risk, you're going to want to get those earlier. For cervical cancer at 25 and then every five years after that. Now patients and experts agree you need to listen to your body no matter how old you are. I got engaged on a Saturday um, and was living on a high, and then uh, two days later, I found the lump. Ten days later, Sydney Simmons was diagnosed with breast cancer at just 25 years old, something she never expected. A lot of diseases, especially cancer, does not discriminate, just like death does not discriminate with any age. And so um, at 25, if you would have told me at 24 this was going to be my story, I would have laughed at you, right? Now, in remission after surgery and months of harsh treatments, Simmons wants women to make their health a top priority. You know your body best, and so if something's not feeling right, I know that we get into this space of not wanting to go to the doctor because of the cost of it, and that is 100% true. Um, but had I not taken that step when I found it, I was already stage three. Kate Middleton's cancer diagnosis after abdominal surgery has started conversation among both physicians and survivors, hoping the news helps women realize if it can happen to royalty, it can happen to anyone. So when I heard about this, um, in some ways it shook me because um, you just never know what someone is going through. Oncology experts like Novant Health's Dr. Elizabeth Skinner hope Kate Middleton's public announcement encourages women to get health checkups. Having it checked out and being reassured is a lot better than not getting it checked out and finding out that there's something more serious down the road. Dr. Skinner says Middleton's diagnosis at 42 is another reminder that cancer affects all ages. And as the population of cancer patients becomes younger and we're starting to see some of these cancers in younger individuals, um, I think having that awareness and being aware, in addition to, again, paying attention to your body and what your body's telling you, I think can be very powerful. Powerful indeed. Dr. Skinner says talking about cancer risks with your family and doctors is really important too. A history of certain types of cancer in families can put you more at risk yourself and might mean that you should be screened at an earlier age.